I can still remember my uh, primary school classes. There was there was myself. There was an Egyptian boy called Richard Bahaja, and and then there was the Aboriginals uh, boys, the Ellers, a couple of others, and then they're all white Anglo-Saxon. Yeah, you know, when you're young, you want to be part of the group. You want to be included. Social. Yeah, you know, we're social beings, humans. And I knew the only way I could do it was getting the cricket team and getting the, and at that stage, the rugby league team. I worked really hard to try to get in there. And once I got in there, then it sort of elevated me to another level. And I, I remember feeling so sorry for Richard Bahaja. He just, he got all the rubbish and it was tough for him. He was quite a bright boy and he became a lot more uh, uh, reclusive because he, he got a, a tougher time than I did. And so you got carried away carried along in the sports team uh, because of that. The other great thing, my mother was a great role model because she didn't carry grudges like people would be racist to her, but she wouldn't carry a grudge. Today, you know, when people say things to you, I still feel sorry for them. Yeah, I remember we had that run in in South Africa and and uh, some bloke was yelling out this most stupid stuff and, and, we, and we raced up and we were going to have him on. I, I just felt sorry for him. It was, you know, it's his problem, not not my problem. What do you make of the world today, kind of thing? I mean, do you, do you look and, and see progress? Do you look and see utter despair, you, particularly in a sporting environment? And we, you know, you look at Colin Kaepernick, and and it's more topical, certainly, I think, than it's ever been in my lifetime before. But but how do you see it as someone who's lived through it and and and, and the reemergence of the issues that we're we're discussing today? I think we we're always making progress. I think we're making progress in the right way. And at times there are events that shows the progress uh, has stabilised and we need to keep driving it forward. And I think that's that's always the case, that this, this latest, latest round where it's sort of everything's all come together at a certain time has, has shown that we've probably stabilised for a period of time. We need another kick along, another reminder. Let's make sure we are being fair and equal to everyone. 